Hello, beautiful people. It's your girl, K E R R Y Carrie, and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, I focus on fashion, 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 lifestyle, travel, and beauty. So, if that is something you are interested in, I would love to have you come and join the crew. So, don't hesitate. Just go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you never miss a post. Today's video is a fun styling video. I try to do these every season and so today's video is all about Pinterest inspired outfits for spring and summer. Uh, we're going to go ahead and get straight into the video. So grab your water, grab your coffee, grab your tea, grab your drink of choice and let's go. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. I hope you have your drink and you're ready to go because I have 10 looks for you. All these looks are inspired by Pinterest. Inspired meaning I may have the same item or I may have similar items. I'm pulling these items from my closet. So maybe just one or two of the pieces are new but most of it is straight from my closet and I always encourage you guys to shop your closet. That's why we buy clothes so that we don't have to keep buying over and over, okay? So this video is mainly for inspiration. I'm definitely going to try to find similar pieces and link them for you if I can find them. If I can't, I'll just let you know in the description box. But Without any more rambling, let's go ahead and get straight into the video. Now, as I told you, these looks are inspired uh, by Pinterest. So I am going to be putting up on the side somewhere um, the inspiration picture for each look. And then I'm going to put the cutaway with how I style that look or my interpretation of that look some things might change some things might be the same depending on what that look is because sometimes me get lucky i'm gonna find something where yeah i have it so that's a plus i guess um now uh, in my video where i talked about how to appear better how to look more expensive i spoke about getting inspiration from social media like Pinterest, Instagram, TikTok, YouTube, you name it, a friend or family. So this is me using my own suggestion, my own tip to find and put together looks from my closet. So again, let's go ahead and get straight into the video, starting out with what I'm wearing, of course, because... I love this look. I think I actually pulled off the inspiration and I'm pulling it up on the side. I'm also going to be using my phone to just like talk about what the look is like. I can't find my phone. <laughs> Excuse me. It, it's right here. <laughs> um, I am going to be looking in my phone to talk about uh, what the look looks like and you will see it on the screen as I talk about it So the first look which is what I'm wearing of course, and I absolutely love it. It's a little white dress and I love this look. This is the perfect summer look if you don't have a little white dress This is your moment Summer is not here yet. So you have a little time. I'm gonna put in as I'm gonna try to find as many as I can and put them in the description box for you. So you can go on in and grab your little white dress. Uh, she's wearing a white uh, button down dress. Um, her waist though is like, it's, hers is a drop waist with poofy sleeve. She has collars. She's wearing um, like two different uh, chunky necklaces, a longer one and a shorter one. She's wearing um, black frames or brown frames. She has this uh, crossbody bag, which is in um, like a mint green or aqua green. And she also has on those um, Valentino uh, platform shoes. Those were trending heavily last year. 
and when I saw this, I was like, I have to recreate this. And so I was in Walmart, yes, Walmart, and I saw this dress and I picked it up. I was like, okay, this will go perfect for this inspiration. And so I'm popping up on the side, oh, I styled it. Uh, I'm wearing the, these uh, chunky necklace, they're from Amazon. I'm also wearing these like the Bottega drop earring, teardrop earring. Um, these are also dupes from Amazon. I got them in silver as well. So um, this is uh, the silver one. And I went ahead and I have these, the dupes to the Valentino platforms that she's wearing. I really wanted to splurge on these last year, but I saw these and um, I was like, let me buy these and see if it is something that I'm gonna wear before I invest, what, $1,200, $1,300 in a shoe that I may not wear. And I haven't worn this a ton, and I think mostly it's because it's not really comfortable um in terms of like the stitching around the shoes but the platform everything else is good so i'm still not sure if i'm going to splurge on these just yet maybe if i get them like on a good sale especially now that they're not um so trendy anymore but i love them i love the color and then i paired the look with uh my little um my micro Fendi baguette bag. It is crossbody, or I can wear it like if I'm wearing jeans, I can hook it onto one of the loops. I absolutely love this look. I think it came out perfect. I think I was really close. So let me know what you think in the comments. Do you think I nailed it? I am going to put up the inspo pic on the screen again, and then also um the video so you can tell me did i get it right or no nah, you need to go wheel and come again go back go back inside and come back <laughs> let me know all righty next up outfit number two and outfit number two is another favorite they're all my favorites let, let me just say it because i picked out looks that i would really wear also looks that would give me like some challenge in terms of like putting the pieces together and have me like stepping out a little bit out of my norm so i hope that you guys get to see that as well so this one is I'm popping it up on the screen. She's wearing a she's wearing a jumpsuit, but this is a cargo style or utility style um, jumpsuit. And you guys know that the utility cargo trend is still heavy this year. It is still one of this year's biggest trends. So trend. So if you are into that, then you'll probably love this look. So she's wearing this overall, or we would I would call it a jumpsuit, a one and done. And she hers is like a tan um, nude, and she has a purple bag and yellow shoes. Those two like complementary colors, along with the um, tan to just like tone it down. down absolutely love it now i don't have a tan jumpsuit but i do have this blue which is a navy blue jumpsuit and this jumpsuit was part of the um kilo walker times amazon the drop collection that dropped um earlier this year and she did have a tan one and i didn't get it and i'm so mad but I got the navy blue one and I bought this one because I was like, I really don't have anything navy and I think that I would get like a ton of wear out of this and I absolutely love. You guys would have seen a shorts, a rail, a TikTok, you name it. 
at Pinterest. If you are on Pinterest, please follow me at cast underscore styles. Yes, I'm on Pinterest. So follow me over there. I shared five ways to style this jumpsuit because if me can't style it multiple ways, me not buy it. Let me say that again. If I cannot style it more than one time, I'm not buying it. I have to get multiple wears out of my pieces, okay? Good. You have to see me in there and see me again and again and again because me go wear my clothes. So I opted to uh, do different complementary colors. And so I paired this with a yellow bag, yellow on the blue, and orange shoe. Oh, so good. Now you're seeing it on the cutaway. Let me know your thoughts. Do you think those colors complemented each other along with the blue? I know the yellow against the blue looks so good. I went ahead and cuffed up my pant leg because it wouldn't like show my shoe, um, a lot of my shoe. So I went and cuffed um, the leg of my pants, but I still, I absolutely love this look. Let me know what you are thinking. Me get a right tiki or a wrong bang? Wrong bang in a move or, or straight tiki? Let me know. Alrighty, so we're on to look number three. Look number three is um, she's wearing these um, silver pants and you guys know silver is another one of this year's uh, top fashion trends she's wearing a um, cut out not like not a V but I don't even know what to call that shape more like of like a sweet art um, cut out of the top I don't, I'm not sure if it's a bodysuit. I think it's a bodysuit. And then she threw threw on a jacket over it, a black um, full leather jacket. She's carrying a black bag and she's wearing black and silver um, sandals. And she does have that red lip that I love. My um, Rihanna MVP velvet matte lipstick would do justice to that and this particular outfit i would definitely wear out to maybe a date night um also like an event this outfit would work perfect for this now i don't have a silver pants but i do have a silver skirt and um I'm not sure if you were around when I spoke about me buying a silver skirt and Obi was like, me look like foul paper. See skirt here, as she calls it. That skirt here calls me good, good husband. For call me, me look like me wrap up in a foul paper. Like, why would you say that? Why would you even say that when I'm going to be standing beside you looking like a foul paper? Because I'm definitely going to wear this to date night. <laughs> But I don't have a silver pant and pants, and that is why um, it is inspiration. So I'm substituting the silver pants for the silver skirt, and this silver skirt is from Fashion Over. I've had it for a while. I'm not sure if it is still available, but if it is, I will link it for you. I've also found, I think, two silver pants that I will link in the description box as well. So if you are not fond of the skirt, then you can go with the pants. And then I've had this top, which is a similar like cutout to the top that um, the inspo picture, that's in the inspo picture. This I've added, I think since last year, I got this from Nasty Gal. Definitely don't think it is still available, but I know it is a dupe to the bodysuit or the top that is sold at um, the Pixie Market. So I will link that one for you if you are interested in getting that. Or if I find anything similar that is more affordable, I'll link that as well. So that's the top. And then the bomber jacket. This is from uh, Zara. Again, I've had this for a while. But they've been making quite a few of these. And so I will link that for you as well. And so you're seeing it on the cutaway on the side. Let me know what you're thinking. I went ahead and paired it with my 
Bottega Jody dupe that is a more affordable version of the Bottega du Jody dupe that's from Amazon I'll link that as well and then I'm wearing my um, Balenciaga knife meal because I didn't have any strappy black and silver um, sandals that look like the inspo pick so again I used my imagination and just switched it out for something else that I thought would actually go well with the look so um, that is my take on look number three let me know what you're thinking did I nail it would you have switched out the pants for a skirt or would you wait until you actually get a pants me me not me not wait I'm not waiting that is why it's called inspiration not for you to um, take it and get it down to the T but for you to use it like as a skeletal frame so that you can actually put your outfit together and have an idea of what it should look like okay good so let me know your thoughts in the comments let's go look number four is it four yes look number four is giving me casual um model of duty casual but i got style i know i i, I know my itch okay and this girl right here lori arvey miss lori arvey she knows her ish like i love her fashion like i would wear every single thing she wears she can send them to me including the body yeah <laughs> she can send it to me but she's wearing these um denim pants um a white button down shirt and if you are new here make one of the student them were there a long time was well seasoned tell you how i feel about a white button down shirt okay in short you need one so stop the video go to the description box i'm linking a ton for you you need a white button down shirt you're gonna be seeing it multiple times in this video let's move on um, she's wearing a white um, bralette. She's wearing brown sandals with a brown bag. And she's wearing black sunnies. So your girl took this look. And I was really inspired. I was like, this is a great look for the weekend, for shopping run. Just a casual type of vibe and i love it i loved how it turned out and you're gonna see it on the cutaway so again i have my andy dandy white button down shirt this is from h m every year i buy like two or three of them from h m because um i wear makeup it catches it it messes it up and when i can't be bothered i just um throw it out and then i'm pairing it with my denim pants these with the slit on the side they're from pretty little thing um, but I'm sure you have denim pants or, or I will link a few faves or if I can find this particular one I will link it for you as well and then I'm wearing this white bralette again that's from H&M I've had that for maybe a year or two and then for um, sandals I showed these um, in my last vlog because I wore them while I was in Miami um, those are from uh, Shoots. Absolutely love them. So this is what they look like. I love the bamboo button. And I think that these are dupes to, I think, Celine. A Celine. Um, these were less than $200. When I say comfortable, these are so comfortable. They come in um, cream or white and also black. I think I'm gonna get the cream one as well. A ton of you have bought um, the cream ones that I've shared, so thank you guys so, so much for always using my links. I get a small percentage of your purchase. It doesn't affect your cost or anything, but it helps me to bring these videos to you, so thank you guys so, so much for using my links. Follow me on the Shop LTK app and on Amazon so you can shop my storefront. But I love this look. The black sunnies are from Amazon. Absolutely love the shape of those. And then my chunk bag, 
I've had this for so long, I don't even know where I got it. I, I, I've had this for more than five years, but it is so like nice and sturdy. Like, do you see that? And I know I did not pay a lot for it, but I just can't remember where I got it from. And so that is the look. Let me know your thoughts. Did I nail it? How do you like? Let me know. Alrighty, outfit number five. So we're halfway there, outfit number five. And this one was mostly, the inspiration for this one was mostly for the color blocking because um, I'm putting it up on the side. She's wearing a um, blue hoodie top with um, pink cargo pants, pink bag, and blue shoes. So, again, I saw this, I was like, I love this color combo, the blue and the pink. Looks so good together, and so you guys know I'm a color gal, so I had to. I had to. I couldn't help it. I had to go ahead and I had to recreate this look, of course. And so I have this blue top and it's not a hoodie top, but it's blue and it's fancy. It is um, like a semi share. It has um, feathers on the head, on the end. It is a long sleeve, absolutely love the fabric on this. And this is from a brand called um, Layette, Layette de Coco. Um, I think it is an Australian brand. I'm not sure. I saw one of my blogger friends um, in this top and I immediately fell in love with it. I was like, please send me the link to buy this. And she sent it. I've, I've had this top since last year. Never worn it. But guess what? It's going to come out. And you guys are seeing it first. And so I went ahead and paired it with this uh, pink wash um, cargo pants. It is from uh, Fashion Nova. Um, you guys always ask me every time um, you see uh, the cargo pants in one of my shorts or my reels. I get them from Fashion Nova. Like, look at it. And then look at both colors together. Everything. You are seeing it on the cutaway. Absolutely love, okay? So I went ahead and paired it with my blue um, rhinestone shoes. Those are from Zara, again, old. And then my coach pink bag, again, old, because we're shopping our closet. So if you have something up in the same color wave, it doesn't necessarily have to be the same exact thing, because you can see it wasn't the same exact thing, but using the color wave, you can absolutely recreate a look like this. Absolutely love how it turned out. Let me know your thoughts. I normally size up in my cargo pants, and so these are in a size 13. I need to take the waist in just a tad bit, but other than that, I love these pants. Like, I have not worn this one yet either, and I can't wait to wear it out during the spring and summertime. Well, mostly summer because spring is almost done. But this is a great color for summer. So let me know your thoughts on look number five. Alrighty, so we are off to look number six. Look number six. And I'm popping it up on the screen. Look number six is... Um, I think this is Ailey Bieber. She's wearing this lime green set. She's wearing this lime green uh, skirt set with like big cargo or utility pockets. Again, the utility trend, heavy, okay? And she's, she paired that with black bag and um, black shoes. So here's my take on it. Here's my take, which is absolutely, which is very close actually. Uh, um, 
I bought this last year when I was going to New York Fashion Week as one of my outfits for Fashion Week, but I didn't get to wear it. And so, um, this is it. So it is, again, this lemon lime um, shirt with, again, with the big pockets and then the, um, the skirt to match again with the big pockets and so um i didn't have i don't have a black pump like um, um i i immediately went online because i have to get a black pump like how can not how can i miss fashion blogger influencer fashion content creator don't have a black pump like how Make it make sense. Like that no make no sense, none at all. <laughs> but um knowing me too, I pro even if I add a black pump, I still would not um pair black with this because that is just too safe. Like me not play safe. Mm-mm. Me not play safe at all at all. And because I'm not playing safe. I opted to pair it with lavender. <laughs> Do you see this? Do you see this? Like, you see this? <sighs> like, this is so good. This is so good. N you understand why Mr. Moon wear black? Like, no. If I can have it in color, give it to me. And that's what we're gonna do. So I opted to go with the lavender and the lemon lime and honey. So I paired it with my back box tabby from Coach. They have these in a number of colors. I want, I think the yellow one, absolutely love this together and I'm definitely gonna be wearing this out you're seeing the cutaway let me know what you're thinking because I absolutely love this the pumps are old from Zara but honey <laughs> let me know what you're thinking please thank you Outfit number seven. Outfit number seven is casual but with a little edge. So she's wearing, I'm popping it up on the screen, she's wearing this pink button-down shirt, a white bralette, um, a gray uh, jogger pant in cargo style. Again, the cargo style, living rent-free. Yeah, um, pink pumps, and I think that's like a light, light blue bag. And she's wearing some sunnies as well. So here's my take on this. Again, it's inspiration. So I do have two pink button down shirts. I have a ton of button down shirts, it's not even funny. Um, so I have this one. I got this last year from Asus when I was going to Fashion Week. I saw it. I was like, it's going to be perfect with my sea queen skirt. And it was. Um, on the back, it, it, it's marked um, Weekend Collective. Absolutely love it. Love the big um, pocket one pocket on the side. And then I don't have a gray pants so but i have these that are real similar to what she's wearing um these are from uh river island absolutely love these um they come already cuffed um the big pockets on the side absolutely love and so it is in like light blue so the light pink and the light blue together like again we're doing a pink and blue action, but in different style, like earlier. Yes. And so, um, 
she did pink shoes pink pumps but my pink pumps are too pink they are more on the um, saturated pink side instead of like the powder pink like this so I opted to play off of the white in the shirt and paired it with my um, my white Alexander Wang pointy toe um, shoes absolutely love these they're very comfortable I've worn them into the ground and then uh, this blue Aldo bag I've had this for a while I think I got this at Burlington absolutely love 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 it and for the first time I wore the crossbody on it because I'm a top and a gal but for because I was doing the inspiration I was like let me do crossbody and I loved it I loved it so this could be like a good like concert like outfit because I do love it or a girl's night out outfit absolutely love and then I popped on my little sunnies these are from Asus love the arts on the side ah uh, so good again this is old I got this last year too when I was going to fashion week so absolutely love how this look turn out let me know your thoughts on it did I nail it do you like um, the fact that I changed up the color wave but like I said earlier the the aim is to um, is to use it as inspiration to put your looks together but not necessarily to get it exactly as the inspiration okay so let me know what you're thinking on loop number seven here we go look number eight look number eight is I think this was one of the easiest ones to do and I did this one because um, this is another like one of this year's biggest I think this is this year's biggest trend mostly because it is the easiest trend to wear right now because we're always wearing it and of course it's denim also let me know in the comments if you want a denim outfit idea video in let me know in the comments if you want a video like that so I can start putting it together for you guys but this is a trend that everybody can wear everybody can wear this trend we all have denim but remember when we're talking about denim we're thinking about thinking outside of the box um, add a little pizzazz to it okay this was easy to um, to recreate because it's there's nothing much to it it's I'm putting it up on the screen she's wearing a denim shirt she has the two big pockets I've been looking for one of those I will definitely share it with you whenever I find it but I'm definitely looking for um, one of these shirts I'm not spending Prada money so please don't send me the Prada one next up excuse me she's wearing denim pants and she's wearing black sunnies and she has a green bag um, I can't really see good the shoes that she has on but it looks like either gold or silver with a strap across her toes and so I'm gonna go ahead and use what I have to replicate this look um, again easy to recreate um, I've shared this uh, denim shirt with you guys before it is from Asus I got it in a size medium it's an oversized shirt so I la absolutely love how it fit I can wear this over a dress or um, biker shorts and something and then the uh, denim pants the jeans pants these are old from Zara I've had this for quite these for quite some time um, but Zara bring them back like every time every now and then so I'll definitely share some in the description box for you I went ahead and paired it with my green um, I think this bag is from Maj so this is my like clover leaf bag I've had this for like more than five years I'm never letting go off of it it's a crossbody and uh, um, waist bag in one and then I opted to go for these 
shoes. When I tell you these are so comfortable, they're from JC Penny. I did a collaboration with them on Instagram for December and they sent me these and when I tell you they are so comfortable they have the comfort foam inside of it so you can keep wear this for hours the bottom has the grip on it so you don't have to worry about slipping and sliding absolutely love this is in gold because I was playing off of the gold in the purse and then the black sunnies can't even remember where these are from i've had them for so long don't even remember where they're from but i'll definitely look to see if i can find anything that is similar to this for you guys but yeah this look this look it again simple but effective like it not kill up itself it's just simple and nice and it, it's getting the job done so let me know what you think almost there we are at look number nine look number nine again taking a simple outfit putting on some eels a nice sunnies dressing it up and take it from zero to 100 now she's wearing popping it up on the screen she's wearing this uh, orange short set and um, pink pumps she has on a Louis Vuitton she has a Louis Vuitton um, mini backpack and she does have her brown frames stuck onto her shirt love this look the moment I saw it I was like yes this is definitely a great summer look that we can pull off okay and so I quickly ran to my closet to pull this out like boom highlighter let me highlight your day <laughs> so this short set is from Shein um, I featured this short set last year in my Shein like summer vacation all I the last time I wore this too was last year when I went to Jamaica I was coming back if you guys watch that vlog I wore this as an airport outfit and we're restyling it to wear again this year not to the airport but maybe for a friday night drink with the girls maybe to a concert because this i can definitely wear to a concert absolutely love it if it is still available i will definitely link it for you i got it in a us 810 and you will see on the cutaway how it fits the shorts as pockets and I went ahead and paired it with my pink pumps now these are old from Asus but we can find these all over so I will definitely find similar ones now look at the color combination baby like pink and orange is a vibe okay and then I opted to go for this um, tortoise uh, color uh, sunglasses and um, I don't have a Louis Vuitton mini backpack but I do have a Louis Vuitton toiletry pouch and it that it, it gets the job done it matches the sun is tone it down a bit absolutely love you're seeing it on the cutaway let me know what you are thinking about this look again simple but effective it gets the job done I can wear this out during the summer and I'll be good I can wear like a bralette under it and leave the shirt open you name it I can do a full tuck half tuck one side in the rest of the um, shirt out just jazz it up the best way you know how and we're down to the last look the last look is um, this is fashion goddess okay <laughs> um, this is uh, Tanika Tanika B on um, Instagram and all platforms absolutely love her style she does a lot of like extra poofy resort wear because she's always traveling so she comes at the vibes all the time she's wearing this green 
a biker short set. Uh, she's wearing a white button down shirt, but this is like a, um, the extra long one. It could can be worn as a dress as well. She's wearing a green Dior saddle bag, the mini one crossbody. And she's wearing um, those night dunks in black and white. So, um, you notice I had, I think I had like two shorts. So this one and the last, Norm, I'm not a shorts girl. So I really stepped out of the box a little bit. And I'm loving it. This look is on the casual side. This is giving me running errands. This is giving me walking my kids in the park. This is giving me grocery shopping. Yeah. And so I have this uh, pink biker short set. It's from Amazon. It is from the Amazon The Drop store. They're from their uh, staple pieces. When I tell you this is so good, oh my God, the fabric is amazing. I got the top in it as well. So I got the shorts in a size small because it does have a lot of stretch in it. So I would suggest sizing down because it does have a lot of stretch, even the top as well. I got the top in a medium, but I could definitely do a small in the top. But I know I'm not gonna wear it just like this. I could probably do like a denim jacket over it or something. I'm definitely not gonna wear it by itself like that or even a blazer over it. And then I have my long, my extra long white button down shirt. Again, this is from H&M, I got this last year. So I'll definitely check to see if they brought it back this year. It is the same one I think as um, Tanika is wearing. Absolutely love, love, love this together. I don't have black and white dunks, <clears throat> but I do have green and white and purple ones. And so I opted to go with um, this one as well. And I'm doing um, white sunnies. She wasn't wearing sunnies, but I opted to add um, white sunnies. And then I'm doing a green bag. So the green with the pink, Definitely a great combo. Absolutely love. And then the white to tone it down. You're seeing it on the cutaway. Let me know your thoughts. Let me know what you're thinking. Do you think I nailed this look? Let me know what you're thinking in the comments. And just like that, we've come to the end of another video. Thank you guys so, so much for watching and sticking around to the end. But before you go, make sure that you like this video. And if you have not subscribed, I would love to have you come and join the crew. So subscribe and hit that notification bell so you never miss a post. As always, let me know in the comments which look was your favorite. Also, let me know video suggestions because your girl will be on summer break in what? Seven days? So y'all are gonna be sick of me on YouTube. So send those video suggestions so I can have something to do during the summer, okay? Feed you guys content. <laughs> I love y'all. I will catch you guys in another video. But until then, be good. Mwah.